Hi guys, um, today we are looking at a new wheel set for me. I've got rid of the Boras, the Campag wheels are no more. They have been sold on eBay and are being replaced temporarily, um, I might add, by the Zip 302s. My plan is to use these as like an interim sort of wheel during the summer and then the winter set them on and uh, save up for something like an Envy. Um, Maybe a 4.5, 7.8, something like that. So, into the box, you have another box. These box wheels are very well packaged. Um, it's one thing with zips, they always do tend to look after them in transit, which is nice. Get a couple of protectors on the um, hub itself as well. So you can't go through the box when it's been transferred, so even if it's been stood on, it can't go through the box, which is cool. So, here we are, this is going to be the front wheel. I didn't do an unboxing the rear wheels, I'm just going to do one wheel, which will be about 10 minutes long. Um, and you see, it's kind of, it's exactly the same depth as a 303, it's basically a 303 without any dimples. So, it's, that's why it's called the 302. I'm guessing the, the O2 stands for no dimples. But in there, you get a wheel pack, which is here. Like of any wheels, you get a nice little wheel pack in here. Uh, in here, you do get your quick release, same quick release that you uh, get on the Firecrest wheels. So you do, they haven't cheaped out there, um, it's a nice quality skewer, feels good, light, it's a little bit better design than the old bullet style ones you had to have pointing backwards to be aerodynamically efficient apparently. So that's cool, so we got that there, you also get your rim tape obviously, being a clincher rim, get that on there. You also do get the world's smallest valve extender, just use a 60mm valve, don't even bother with this, it's just pointless. Um, yeah, you also get obviously the core remover as well. But um, the major thing you do not get with these wheels, even though they're 12.99, which is great value, you do not get any brake pads. So be prepared to pay £70 for the recommended brake pads for these wheels on top of that 12.99. Still a, a good priced wheel set, but just be prepared for that. And uh, this is the 76 hub, it's a 176 on the rear. It uses J Bend spokes, so it's easily serviceable, and external nipples. So you sh these should be able to be serviced by anyone. Don't have to send them to anywhere special. Um, nice smooth bearings as well. I might add they uh, do feel pretty pretty decent in the wheel, which is pretty cool. Um, nice 25 mil wide brake track there as well. So yeah, modern wheel seems good. Looking forward to getting out of them and doing some more videos to get there. But hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you want to see more content. And catch you later. Goodbye.